There we go. How does that steal your banking info? I'll show you how. Okay. On this side. Oh, it's we have, all like computer chips. Yep, we have a bunch of circuit boards, we have a battery, and we have a card reader. So this is actually a magnetic strip reader. Okay. And your magnetic strip is going on this side when you put it in. It shows you exactly how to put that in. You slide the card in, so it still functions in the ATM. But this is taking your card information. Okay, so they, but how do they get your pin? Take a look at this. That's the mirror to make sure nobody's too close to you? Right, so this is a mirror, and people use this uh, to, yeah, to see if somebody's looking over your shoulder at your pin number. And that is a false sense of security. Okay. This is not really part of the ATM either. It's actually not even a mirror. It's a bit reflective, but if you look under here, get a shot of this. That's a camera. Wait, what? You can see the lens there? Yeah, I see the lens. And that camera is pointing straight down at the pin pad. Oh. So this is getting all the information off the magnetic strip. And this is reading your pin number. Now, okay. I'm going to try to peel this off as well, and we're going to show you how they're doing. Now, sometimes scammers will come back and collect these things. Yep. But sometimes they don't need to come back and collect them. It depends on the type of skimmer they're using. All right, we got that pried off. Oh, wow. Look at that. There, you get a good shot of that camera there? Yeah, I see the lens. You can see the lens, and that was facing right exactly at the, uh, at the keypad there. There you go, on the inside there. the camera here. That's the camera box. And then... This is probably a transmitter or maybe a receiver for, for this information. Okay, so and it's all in one place. And this is running off of a 9-volt uh, battery, you can see. So that means that they have to come and get it. Well... Like that won't last very long. We're going to find out, because I see something suspicious here. Okay. Look at that. Wait, is that wires? Yep. It all appears to be taped onto there. Okay. So, do you see this? I do. So that's just going back and around, and this is 100% not part of the ATM. This is not part of the ATM. Here's your skimmer. Yeah. Here's your camera, getting your PIN number. This is all receiving information, and then the wire, we know that it's not running power to it because we've got a 9-volt battery in there. Yeah. So this wire is running all the way down the back here, and we've got something here. All right, let me see. I've got it. you got it. I've got something back here. I'm going to need to pry it off. These look really legit, that they, like, looked part of the ATM. Oh. Oh, you found something? What was that? All right. More wire. Check this out. This. It's a phone. This is a phone. That means that they do not even have to come back and collect this stuff. This is all disposable, and they can afford to do this. They're making thousands and thousands of dollars off of people. They've got your card information. They've got your PIN number. It's all being sent to them on this phone. And then that's automatically sent, or they have to come back and grab that phone? They have to come back and get it. Now, I'm looking at this. There is a lot of battery life left on this phone. So you might have caught it quick. I hope we caught this early enough that they didn't scam too many people. Let's check the rest of the machines in the building. Sounds good.